The basics of Weave Chain are attaching data to a weave, sharing it with another party, and earning it as they interact with it. Acme Medical is our data producer, and they'll create a new weave that's tied to a blockchain and then attach their existing oncology patient database to it. Oncotech, our consumer, will connect to that weave, pay to replicate a raw hospital directory, and then pay to run some confidential computing on patient data. Finally, Oncotech will validate the data lineage with the hashes, signatures, and proofs that we've chain created. Let's create a brand new account, which in Web3 consists of a public and private key pair. Then we'll create a new weave, our Web3 data sharing arrangement backed with a blockchain, and launch our node. Now let's connect our database using basic database connection parameters. Let's set it so that patient data can't be accessed directly only through confidential computing. And then we'll set a fee for confidential computing at 100 USDC per day. We'll also set a fee of 10 USDC per 100 records to read from our directory of hospitals. Now we'll copy Oncotech's public key and permission it from Acme Medical. Acme will then share its node address so Oncotech can connect and join the weave. Oncotech can now replicate data locally by inputting the connection string to its local database. This is the magical moment where Oncotech must be ready to pay Acme Medical. Now Oncotech can read directly from the hospital directory but can't see the patient information. In a Jupyter notebook, Oncotech's Python code can interact with a weave chain node. Without being able to read raw patient information, weave chain's multi-party computing lets us calculate correlations or do a regression between smoking and cancer severity. Weave chain's compute to data even lets us securely train a machine learning model on the data so that we can understand the predictive power of different variables on cancer severity. WeaveChain is constantly hashing and signing inputs, computation images, and results to enable cryptographic validation. We've also implemented zero-knowledge proofs, for example to validate that ages are non-zero or between ages 10 and 75. And last but not least, when we go back to Acme Medical's environment, we can see that USDC rolling in. WeaveChain makes it easy to make your data Web3 ready so consumers can pay to use it in really powerful ways. Please feel free to reach out with any questions.